Well, got a bit of a country road trip today. In the middle of packing the car and getting the gear ready and things like that. So talking about Bob Dylan might be a little bit, uh, well, late. <laughs> last week what's going on so I'm just gonna come over here near the window where we have slightly slightly better light so where was I yes that was last week that road trip was last week actually but the gig was three hours away three hours there three hours back so um, it was also my anniversary that day it was also my partner's birthday the next day. So I thought that it was probably best to, you know, not edit videos, make videos over that weekend. So here we are, a week later, talking about Blowing in the Wind um, with my interesting video title um, <laughs> as we break down the songs. So this song, I... I almost feel like I don't need to break this song down. I mean, it's a, it's a Stone Cold classic. So that's part of the reason I play it. It's just a great song. It's just, yeah, um, just a really brilliant song. But Bob Dylan is obviously quite political in many of his songs, and this song's no exception. And it just seems like at the moment, this current climate we have with Trump as president, that these lyrics, you know, speak directly to that situation. Um, as much as they ever would to any situation it just yeah it's it's go back and listen to the lyrics and see if you don't feel the same i mean i'll leave that up to you i mean obviously that's my opinion and everybody's entitled to their opinion but it certainly feels like it kind of speaks to the current climate um even in the world more widely so i thought i'd also mention that i've actually seen bob dylan live which was an interesting experience the the concert was promoted as all of his classics it was going to be all the classic songs and you would you know there's many of them the actual concert he played hardly any of his classic songs the ones that he did play you could hardly recognize because they were so different from the original he spent the most of the night standing kind of side on to his microphone so he could visually communicate with his band and not engage the audience, which was kind of interesting as a performer myself. Bob Dylan is definitely a poet with a guitar rather than an entertainer. So yeah, it was quite, it was quite an interesting experience. I wouldn't go and see him again, let's put it that way. I would save my money. But some of you may have seen him. If you've seen him and you've had a better experience than that, I would love to know. Uh, but yeah, so there you go, guys. Pretty short video in the grand scheme of things. Please comment down below or comment over on Blowing in the Wind, the video. Like the video and, of course, subscribe to my channel. And one little shout out before I go. Go and check out Luke Swinburne. Young guy. Met him at a session last week where we both played a set. A lot of talent. Go and check him out. If you're subscribing to his channel, you have to subscribe to mine, of course. <laughs> I'm Simon, a.k.a. Soul Trader, and we'll see you next time.